sounds delicious. Hey, sorry for waking you up, but I wanted to tell you that we're almost there. Woohoo! We're almost there! Uh, where are we going? Today we're heading to pizza. We're going to get pizza? Oh, I didn't say pizza, guys. I said Pisa. Pisa is a city in Italy, home to the... Uh, uh. Sorry, all this talk about pizza is making me hungry. Well, Pisa has a lot of places for great food, Hoagie. It's also full of beautiful buildings. It's an ancient city on the river Arno. And it's where you can find one of the most famous buildings in the world called the... Oh, oh, I see Pisa, guys. Okay, Pisa, here we come. Passports, per favore. Grazie. Polly. Wow, you've got a fast tongue. Grazie, ciao. I'm Antonio. Ciao to you, too. I'm Hoagie, and these are my friends, Lorna, Bernie, and Floaty. Welcome to Pisa. Are you here for the Luminara of San Ranieri? The Lumina what now? The Luminara of San Ranieri. It's tonight, the biggest festival of the year. And I was just practicing for a big bocce tournament tomorrow. What's bocce? You've never played bocce? Nope. No. Never played. I'll show you. Auntie Amo Avanti. And a whaty? Auntie Amo Avanti. It means, come on, let's go. Oh, all right. Andiamo avanti. Bocce kind of looks like bowling. Actually, it is a little like bowling, but you know, different. Antonio! Ciao, Nanino. My grandfather is one of the best bocce players in Pisa. These are my new friends. I'm about to teach them how to play. And this, this is my lucky palino. My grandfather carved it himself. Now everyone takes turns throwing their ball to see who can get it closest to the palino. And whoever gets it closest wins a point. Oh, let me try. Oh, I'm, I'm all right. <laughs> you should really let go of the ball, Lorna. Okay, you want to go next? All right, here goes. Nice, nice job, Hoagie. Okay, my turn. Way Whoa. to go. Yeah. Now I'll go. Hmm. Hey, you knocked my ball away. That's part of the game. Let's play another one. I need practice for tomorrow. Ah, you're gonna do great. As long as I've got my lucky palino. Me? Uh, all right, here goes. Uh, ah! Look ah! out! Ah! Whoops. Ooh, it looks like he wants to play. I can't fit in there. So now what do we do? I have to get my lucky Paulino back. You guys help Antonio. I'll search for that dog up high and meet you back at the square later, next to the tower. What tower does he mean anyway? Beats me. I think he means the... Huh? Oh, Andiamo Avanti. to a statue, aren't I? Um, yeah. Andiamo <gasps> Avanti! Hold it right there, doggy. Hey, that 
that's mine. Mmm, <gasps> chocolate, mint, and pistachio. That was a close one. Um, you don't happen to have seen the little dog? About this high, barks like this. Bark, bark! <laughs> Actually, I think he barks more like this. Ruff, ruff! It's more like a uh, ruff, ruff. Well, anyway, have you seen him? <sighs> hmm. If I were a dog, where would I be? Uh. Over there! This is the Field of Miracles. We could really use a miracle right now. That dog could be anywhere. And time's running out. I need my lucky Polino. Don't worry, Antonio. We'll get it back. I hope so. I'll go and look on the other side of the cathedral. And we will look on this side. Yeah! Let's do it! Hey! There he is! I'm not letting him out of my sight this time. Just a little closer. Don't take your eyes off that ball, gang! Oh. I'm all right! Oh. oh, no, 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 not again! Wow! Oh, no! Look! We knocked it over! Ah. We'd better fix it before we get into trouble. Here, help me push. It won't budge. Let's try pulling. It's no use. Maybe no one will notice. Are you kidding? Everyone's going to notice the leaning tower. What are we going to do? Oh, no, oh. Antonio is coming. He's bound to notice. Don't, oh, don't look you over do, there. Don't look. It was an accident. What are you talking about? Well, uh, we kind of, sort of, accidentally ran into the tower and knocked it over. And now it's crooked. We tried to fix it. <laughs> No, you didn't knock it over. The tower's been leaning like that for more than 700 years. <laughs> really? Yes, that's why they call it the Leaning Tower of Pisa. <laughs> I knew that. <laughs> Actually, we can climb to the top if you want. We can look for the dog from up there. But we better hurry. It's almost dark. Yeah! Hey, let's do Make it! the way! Andiamo avanti! 294, 295, 296. That's a lot of steps. Oh no, we can't see anything. Crazy. Like I told you, it's the Luminara of San Ranieri. What I didn't tell you is that on this night, we light more than 10,000 candles all over Pisa. It's so beautiful. I guess that's why they call it the Capo dei Miracoli, the Field of Miracles. Let's get a picture. It's crooked, perfect. <laughs> oh, I see you found the Leaning Tower. I was trying to tell you about it, but I didn't really get the chance. Yeah. <laughs> I guess it would have been nice to know it was called that before we got here. Okay, well, hop aboard. I'll take you down. <gasps> the dog! Hey, you! Drop that! Ooh, my lucky Palino! It's a miracle! Thanks, Grandpa. Drop it, huh? <laughs> I wish I'd thought of that. <laughs> I guess he was only running because we were chasing him. Come on! We still have some time to practice for the bocce tournament tomorrow. Yeah! Sure. Do it! This is great! 
but I'm still kind of hungry. Pizza, anyone? Ha-ha! <laughs> oh, oh, I'll have a slice! Pizza in Pisa. <laughs> Ten things about Pisa. One, Pisa is an ancient city on the coast of Tuscany, which is in Italy. Two, the city is full of lots of historic buildings because Pisa is over 2,000 years old. That's seriously old, guys. Three, Pisa is built on the banks of the river Arno. There are lots of bridges that you can cross over to get from one side to the other. Four, the city is very famous, mostly because of one bell tower, the Leaning Tower of Pisa. And can you guess why it's called the Leaning Tower? Yup, that's right, because it's leaning. The tower has been slowly leaning more and more every year in the 700 years since it was built. Five, the leaning tower is found in a square called the Campo di Miracoli. In English, that means the Field of Miracles. Six, another famous building in the Field of Miracles is the cathedral. The cathedral is older than the tower and is nearly 1,000 years old. It is huge. Seven, the second largest square in Pisa is called the Knight's Square, home to the Knight's Palace and the very tall statue of a knight. Eight, you can't go to Italy without trying the famous gelato. Gelato means ice cream. Yay! They have some yummy flavors too. There's even one called bacio, which means kiss. <laughs> Nine, Another strange gelato flavor is Zuppa Inglisi, which is Italian for English soup. Ew! But they don't make it out of vegetables. It tastes a bit like creamy trifle. Mmm! Double yum! 10. The name Pisa sounds a little bit like the word pizza. Pizza wasn't invented in Pisa, but you can still find lots of pizzerias in Pisa, where you can eat pizza until your tummy is completely full. Want to see more? Subscribe and like for more fun songs, stories, and facts.